We have the official news from Honda Racing and Chance Hymas from his Instagram saying, quote, Unfortunately, Hymas aggravated the injury during the opening Super Motocross round September 7th. With the goal of retaining his spot on Team USA for the October 6th MXON, he pulled out of the remaining of the MX series, but after further consultation, Hymas and his team have decided it is more prudent to have the injury repaired as soon as possible, even though there are even though there was high confidence that after two weeks off he would be able to perform at a high level, the possibility of re aggravating injury and adversely affecting Team USA's results was also a consideration. Uh, now, obviously, this he's been racing with this ACL injury all summer long. You know, he's been able to score his first overall victory at the professional level, and you know he has been fast. But it is one of those funny things that, like, you know, if you take the two weeks off for MX of Nations. And then you sit there and do MX of Nations, so there's another week. And then you come fly from there, back home, you got to have the surgery. Then it's eating into time for prep or testing for Supercross. And it's just one of those things that just keeps, you keep pushing it back, keep pushing it back, keep pushing, pushing it back. It's one of those, when does it ever get done? And for him, you know, being as young as he is, you know, you don't want to keep this going, keep you know, making it worse or aggravating it over and over and over again, having like a, you know, a bad knee for the rest of your life, which most of these guys are probably going to anyways. But I don't know. Uh, luckily, you know, if you haven't seen, we've got Cooper Webb filling in for the MX2 class. So exactly, not exactly a uh, step down at all, I would say. But, you know, it's kind of one of those sad things. I think he would have been good. I think he would have been fine in the MX2 class, would have been fast and competitive. But you know, it's better to take time off, get fully healed, you know, just get better and then not have to maybe hurt yourself even worse racing with it. And, you know, you got a really good fill in. So sad to see, sad to hear, but hey, you know, racing is dangerous. Injuries happen and we'll see where it goes from there. But comments down below. You guys tell me, what do you think of Cooper Webb filling in? Do you think he's going to be good in the MX2 class? Do you think he's going to have enough time on the 250 to... I don't know, get acquainted with it. Whatever it is, comment down below. While you're down there, make sure to like, share, subscribe. Do all the fun things this platform allows you to do because it really just helped me out and I appreciate it. And with that, I'll see you later. Peace.